hello guys welcome to the indian call today i'm going to show you the two port network so which is very complex uh, and very confusing chapter so for this reason i'm going to show you how to remember easily if you can follow this pattern no need to do anything in this chapter okay so let's start so what we need to do to remember so first start here yes. v1 v2 i1 and i2 ok then suppose you are here v1 now draw a line from v1 to v2 v1 to i2 v1 to i1 now again from v2 v2 to i2 only ok now go again i1 i1 to I, v2 i1 to i2 ok now next what you need to do you need to name it so 1 1 from v1 to v2 in this arrow 1 opposite 2 then 3 opposite of 3 4 then v1 to i2 5 then i1 to v2 6 okay now remember the eyes b1 to b2 1 is means z parameter i1 to i2 y parameter b1 to i1 3 a b c d parameter okay then opposite of inverse a b c d parameter then b1 to i2 5 a dash means h parameter then 6 is for g parameter okay so this is for the mind mind map okay now let's start explanation part explanation part as you can see that so as you can see guys here z parameter okay now here z parameter now i already told you that one is for z parameter now you can see b1 and b2 b1 and b2 is for output okay now you can see that b1 and b2 for output now b1 okay so what you z1 see b1 b1 z11 into i1 b1 okay i1 means z11 i1 okay z 1 2 1 2 means this okay 1 2 so z 1 2 into i 2 v 2 v 2 take here v 2 okay z 2 1 into i 1 and i 1 is same i 2 i 2 is same so you can remember in this way only i am giving the trick okay to remember now next y admittance model so y parameter how we can remember i1 y, how, i already told you that y is opposite of z so i1 i2 is output so i1 i2 output so what now y11 into v1 y11 into so v1 okay i11 v1 then y12 y12 into v2 so remember i12 then y21 is v1 opposite y22 v2 opposite so same you can remember in this way now e next come to abcd parameter now you can see abcd parameter means v1 and i2 will be our output so here you can see v1 and i1 is our output now from here v1 means a into v2 a into b2 okay now next will be minus okay in a b c d parameter and a dash inverse parameter you have to remember that minus here minus 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 okay now next b1 b means b into i2 b into here from here to here i2 okay as same i1 into c into b2 b2 and i2 okay 
now next a b c d parameter inverse parameter what you need to do what is our our output v2 i2 okay so v2 i2 is will be the our output so a dash into v1 just opposite so you can see what from where v2 we need to stand your v2 okay so v2 into v1 just opposite inverse that is why this is written as inverse so v2 v1 okay v2 i1 okay now next is the opposite of this similarly okay now next h parameter h parameter is nothing but our this one v1 5 okay h parameter as you can see h parameter is opposite of 5 so what do you need to diagonal diagonal line so v1 and i2 will be our output v1 i2 will be our output so what what we need to we need so h11 h11 means 1 1 is into i1 h11 i1 okay h12 h12 is v2 okay 1 2 sorry h12 v2 this way okay then i2 i2 to h21 okay h21 okay as you are otherwise you can remember i1 i1 okay next b2 b2 okay now g parameter now g parameter means inverse of h parameter okay so g parameter is 6 so our output will be i1 and v2 so g11 into v1 okay so from here g11 just opposite i already told you that this is inverse parameter so g11 into v1 g12 into i2 g12 into i2 okay guys now next g21 and g21 uh, you know v1 into v1 as same as v1 i2 as same as i2 so this is guys you can i hope you uh, understood all and everything about this and this will be very helpful for the exam as well as for gate so thank you thank you don't thank you for watching this video and don't forget to subscribe my indian corn channel so thank you for watching this video